What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Have to decide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Free general collective reading. So it's very important. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Um, I received a channel message in, so I'm going to do this reading. I hope everybody is doing well today. Okay. So the channel message I received was, an Aquarius is really, 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 um, some have started really, really contemplating, um, sitting and contemplating and evaluating certain situations some are about to uh, very 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 important situations i heard some it is regarding um workplace situations some it is regarding a very important case um and some it is regarding family dynamic um so you plug it in how it resonates that's all i heard so acquiring energy strong you can have Aquarius in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and mid hanger Jupiter charts if this resonates with you. But if this resonates with you, Aquarius, some of you guys are, um, sounds like sitting and really heavily contemplating. Sounds like some already have and some are about to. You have to, only you know your story, not anybody else. So you have to plug the situations in how they resonate. But it sounds like you're about to sit down and really use your air sign energy and really contemplate very important situations. Some, it's regarding, um, workplace situations so some i feel you could be positions of high authority possibly or just evaluating your workplace situation if you're not a position of authority um some i heard is regarding a very important case so some i feel you could be a lawyer you could be a lawyer or you could be a client in a case or you could be a judge or something of that nature but some kind of very important case energy how that resonates um or you could be a part of the case um, or you could be an officer, a police officer, or somebody involved in this case, maybe an investigator. However, that resonates with some kind of very important case energy. Some it's workplace situations. Some it's some kind of family dynamic situation. So I feel it could be your family dynamic or somebody else's family dynamic. However, that resonates. Um, but a lot of heavy contemplative energy. Um, heavy, heavy, heavy contemplative energy if this resonates for you. Um, however, that resonates in one's life. A particular Aquarius is about to really, really realize they made a huge mistake in the past and start amending it. Some really getting people in in a workplace situation that will benefit the company. cohesive union some really evaluating a particular case and making help making huge changes to balance the situation okay so you plug in how it resonates wow heavy case energy in here there's some kind of case in the universe i feel this is legal um, but you plug it in how it resonates um so we're pulling workplace energy strong in here um I do feel some of you guys are positions of authority, but you're evaluating people or situations or hiring. You could be hiring or firing or what have you, but um, I heard getting people in there to form a cohesive union. So um, I feel you're you're part of the hiring or firing process um, for some of you Aquarians. Um, for some, you could be owners of businesses possibly, or like manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO energy, how that resonates. But um, however that resonates, you're about to make huge changes. And I did a reading, uh, I think it was a couple days ago about universal shift energy. So for some of you guys, you can go back and check that reading out if it resonates for you. But I feel you might be part of the universal shifter energy for some of you guys. But it's really getting people in there, I think, in positions that should be in there or deserve to be in there or that can perform the job functions properly or what have you. I feel you are the universal shift your energy in some of you guys' situations, um, and you're about to make it happen. 
Um, you're sitting there, I feel you're sitting there thinking about situations and thinking about scenarios and thinking about people. And this is in a, that's in a workplace situation. So you're thinking about who needs to be in what spot and um, who to hire and if you need a fire and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, for some of you guys. And for some, it is um, some kind of very important case energy. So definite legal energy, definite legal energy. Um, I don't know if you're an investigator. I don't know if you're a lawyer. I don't know if you're a judge. I'm not sure, but evaluation of a case. Um, I heard for some of you guys, you realized you made a huge mistake in the past and you're going to start helping amend it and help bring balance to the situation. So some kind of balance situation, whether it's in the workplace situation or whether it's in some kind of case situation. However, in the world that resonates in your life, we have wisdom on the bottom of the deck, owl spirit. So I feel this is knowledge. Maybe for some, I feel you've just learned some knowledge on uh, on this case or your workplace dynamic or employees you want to hire or employees you need to fire or employees in your workplace situation or what have you because there's two situations there's a workplace situation there's some kind of case legal s type situation um but i feel you have just learned wisdom i.e knowledge of this or you're about to um i feel some kind of factual information here um or i feel factual information um on this situation is what i'm feeling I feel for some you can be investigators. For some. You plug it in how it resonates. A particular Aquarius has just recently learned some very important information. A particular Aquarius is about to learn some very important information. It's about to make them do, do things they never thought they were about to do, but they are because so much truth is about to come out. Some has already come out. Balance needs to be restored. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. Wow, that was a long one. Okay, so some of you guys have just learned some information. I feel it's factual. I don't feel it's opinion. I feel it's fact for some of you guys. And um, it's either regarding a workplace situation or a workplace dynamic or like hiring and firing energy or I feel you are in universal shifter energy, whoever you are, whoever I'm pulling in here. So your universal shifter energy in both of these situations. So, but you learn, some have just learned information. Some is about to, and I don't feel it's opinions. I don't feel it's gossip. I feel it's factual information. And it's about to open your mind and make you think about some kind of situation, either in a workplace dynamic or uh, some kind of legal S type case. Um, and it's about to make you be a universal shifter in some shape, form, or fashion. Now, however, you're going to be a universal shifter, whether it's in this workplace company dynamic or this case energy, however, this resonates. But definite knowledge here, knowledge. I don't feel it's gossip. I don't feel it's. Um, I don't feel it's gossip and just blah, 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 blah. I feel it's true. I feel it's true. Here are messages you have reflected. Way too many. Way too many. I feel maybe some of you guys, you've been up in your feelings about this situation. Maybe emotional. Or you're dealing with somebody with um, addictions. Because this is excess. This is excess. I have four cards. So I feel for some of you might have been dealing with somebody with addictions in your workplace. Or you are dealing with somebody with addictions in your workplace. Um, or you were just emotional about the situation in your workplace or this legal case. Maybe somebody in this legal case has addictions. Um, possibly. Or you're emotional about this case. Or the workplace situation. How that resonates. Courage reversed. Aspen spirit did not have courage in the past, but really about to step it up in a huge way. Okay, I heard did not have courage in the past, but you're really about to step it up in a huge way. So you didn't have courage about the situation in the past, but you're about to step it up in a huge way. And number three could be very significant number in one's life. Number three, 
could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible social security card number, possible jersey number. So courage reverse, you did not have courage uh, with the situation in the past, but I think this knowledge, this wisdom, this information, whatever it is, and however it plays in your life, only you know your story, not anybody else, is about to help influence and situate you being a um, universal shifter energy in this situation. And I feel for a lot of you guys, you're you're high, you're high up on the totem pole, um, and you can help influence this situation. Hopefully, in a positive situation. Um, hopefully in a positive way and not a negative way. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. But you didn't have courage in the past, but it sounds like you're about to soon. And once you do, it'll turn it upright and it'll be courage upright. So you plug it in however it resonates. Spirit messages you have to play this. Stability, reverse, purity, upright. Sanctuary upright. Number 14, 45, or 26 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 14, 45, or 26. It could be possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible social security card number, possible jersey number. 14, 45, or 26. Stability reversed. A particular Aquarius has stole from someone in the past. They're about to have to pay all the money back. A particular Aquarius knows someone was stole from in the past. And they're about to reveal information on it. Okay, so you plug in and how it resonates. So one of you guys stole from someone in the past, but I heard you're about to have to pay it, pay it back. So you have to pay the money back. Now, whoever you stole from, a governmental entity, energy agency, or a person or people, but at least one Aquarius in this situation stole from somebody, it's about to have to be paid back. And for another Aquarius, you know somebody um, was stole from and you're about to reveal the information. Now, whoever you're about to reveal it to, police, a governmental entity, agency, energy, whoever, but you're about to reveal information that person or people or family or situation or what have you was stole from. And kudos to you if that resonates for you. Purity upright. One particular case is a very important child custody case. Stockholm Syndrome was used here. Abusive tactics was used here. This Aquarius knows it. They're about to help balance it out in a huge way. For one of these Aquarians, people connected in their personal life or is receiving very negative karma because of this past energy imbalance, they know this. Oh my Lord, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. So one of these is a child custody case, very important child custody case. Um, you could be a lawyer involved in this, a judge involved in this, uh, uh, opposing counsel involved in this, primary counsel, counsel involved in this. Um, somehow, you're involved in this. You could be DHR, you could um, be Child Protective Services, you could be um, police, you could be anything attached to this child custody case, how this resonates. But um, I heard you know Stockholm Syndrome was used in this um, and a lot of lies and a lot of lies. Stockholm Syndrome and a lot of lies was used in this. So some kind of manipulation of a or attempted manipulation of a child custody case in some shape, form or fashion. For some, it could have actually, I feel for some, it, yeah, it was, a, it was manipulation. I heard Stockholm Syndrome. So somebody has used Stockholm Syndrome upon child or children to try to acquire them is exactly what it sounds like here. Um, purity in this situation is the children energy is what I'm feeling. And they've used Stockholm Syndrome, a lot of lies and manipulation to acquire these children or attempt to acquire them. Um, I feel you're working this case. Um, I don't feel this is a workplace energy. I feel this is a case energy as this resonates, but you know this and 
at least one of you Aquarians, I heard, are connected to this important child custody case. You have somebody in your own personal life connected to you. Now, whoever it is, it could be a child, uh, your child, it could be a family member, it could be a neighbor, it could be a co-worker, it, somebody connected to you in your own personal life um, that is receiving negative karma because there's some kind of imbalance in this child custody case involving Stockholm Syndrome, a lot of lies. And Stockholm Syndrome and a lot of lies is basically abuse. It's abuse. So somebody is trying to, either trying to acquire well, I heard child custody case, so they're trying to acquire the children. They have not acquired them officially yet, but they're trying to legally acquire them uh, through, the, through the justice system. But with Stockholm Syndrome, abuse, a lot of lies, manipulation. Um, but you know this or you're about to find this out. And basically somebody connected to you in your own personal life, Aquarius, if this resonates to you, with you, is acquiring heavy karma in their own personal life because of this child custody case. So, so, so somehow somebody personally connected to you in your own personal life is somehow connected or was connected into this child custody case and now they're receiving negative heavy karma because it sounds like it hasn't been balanced out yet. But it sounds like you're a universal shifter energy that can help balance this out and it sounds like you're about to. So purity energy in this situation is children and the balancing of the situation. You being, i.e. you being the universal shifter energy to balance it out. Because people are getting negative karma in this situation because it's not balanced. It's not balanced. Somebody's trying to acquire children with Stockholm Syndrome, a lot of lies and manipulation. I mean, when you try to acquire anything through Stockholm, Stockholm Syndrome is dangerous. And if you don't know what Stockholm Syndrome is, please, I encourage you to Google it because it's very, 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 it's very dangerous. It's very strong mental manipulation. And in this case of children, the purity energy and that's terrible because when you start messing with somebody's psyche as a child who's to say when they become an adult they don't become warped because of abusive person or people in their life and in this case i think it's family members abusing them uh people trying to acquire them through stockholm syndrome abuse and a lot of lies sanctuary and we have trust reverse too underneath that Many people have received negative karma because of this imbalance. It really needs to be balanced out. You know this. For the workplace situation and the child custody case. Okay, I heard many people have received negative karma um, in this situation already in the past. So they've already received negative karma. So that could be the, um, they want sanctuary. They want peace. They want sanctuary. They want peace in this situation. They want this to be balanced out, but it's not. It's not right now, but it sounds like it can be, and it sounds like you can help balance it, but it hasn't been done yet, basically. Um, but many people in the past have received negative karma because of all this crap, basically, and it hasn't been balanced out in the universe, but it sounds like you're a universal shifter energy that can help balance it out. So people want peace and sanctuary, and the children deserve a nice stable grounded dependable parent that actually cares about them that actually cares that will do the right thing that will not um place them under stockholm syndrome or abuse them mentally and screw up their mind basically and no child deserves that no child deserves that now does it happen in the universe absolutely but does do child children deserve that no absolutely not so it's sanctuary upright Number 26 or 9 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 26 or 9 or 45 or 14. 26, 9, 45 or 14. And then trust reverse. You do not trust this situation. You shouldn't have in the past. One particular Aquarius is about to really, really step up. 
Okay, I heard you do not trust this situation and you shouldn't have in the past. So if this resonates for you, Aquarius, you trusted this situation in some shape, form, or fashion in the past, but I heard you shouldn't have, but you did, and now it's created all this crazy crap. Stockholm Syndrome with the child custody case, with a lot of lies and manipulation, screwing up children's psyches or trying to screw up children's psyches, and creating imbalances in the universe and all kinds of crazy crap. So, but, um, but it sounds like you don't trust it now. You don't trust it now. You did it in the past, but you don't now. Because I think you're seeing whoever this is connected in your personal life receiving negative karma. And they're going to continue to receive negative karma. If something doesn't get balanced out. And soon. Okay, and I heard they're going to continue to receive negative karma if, so, if something doesn't get balanced out soon. So whoever this is in your personal life for the child custody case over here, Aquarius, I'm feeling. I mean, I, you plug it in how it resonates. For some, it could be the workplace situation, but I feel like these messages are for the child custody case. But you plug it in how it resonates. But whoever's connected to this child of custody case, Aquarius, in your universal shifter energy, so I feel your position of authority, you can help balance this out. Somebody in your personal life, I don't feel it's you, somebody connected to you, and they're receiving heavy, heavy negative karma, but I heard they're going to continue until this gets balanced out. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. It's not balanced out yet, but I feel you can help balance it out. And I heard it needs to be balanced out soon. So, I mean, this is terrible. This is really terrible. I heard you trusted this situation in the past, but you don't now. But I think it's because you're seeing someone in someone or some people in your personal life receiving all this negative heavy karma because of this imbalance of this child custody case basically and you want peace and sanctuary and peace and sanctuary for your people connected to you and who doesn't want peace and harmony for the ones they love and care about and that's just the truth um uh, that's the truth so you plug it in how it resonates let me see if i hear anything else Several shocking series of chain of events are about to occur with this situation. Someone's about to get a surprise phone call very soon. Okay. Her several shocking series of chain of events are about to occur with this situation. Someone's about to get a very shocking phone call soon. So it could be you about to get a shocking phone call or someone you're connected to. But someone's about to get a shocking phone call um, in this. It could go both ways. You could you could be giving the shocking phone call or receiving the shocking phone call or both. However that resonates, um, maybe the shocking phone call energy is both maybe the workplace and the child custody situation possibly. You plug it in how it resonates, however that resonates for you. All right, you guys. Well, I hope this helped. I love you guys so much and namaste.